Hello everyone. Welcome to Brain Blitz Audios. Today we will be looking at how to solve some 5x5 five five Kakuro puzzles. Please do watch our introduction episode to know more about Kakuro. Let's begin then. This is our first question. Now, let's name the columns and rows. This will be column A, column B, column C, column D and column E. And the rows are column row 1, row 2, row 3, row 4 and row 5. First, let's look at the cell D1. In that the target number is 10 and we already have an 8. So the, the in D1 the number will be 10 minus 8 which equals 2. So we put a T, 2 in D1. Now let's look at D4. The target number is 14 and we already have a 5. So in D4 the number must be 14 minus 5 which equals 9. Now let's look at column E. The target number is 24 and we already have an 8. Now 24 minus 8 equals 16. Now the all the options for 16 is 9 and 7 so 9 or 7 will appear in any of these cases now let's look at row row 5 in that the target number is 17 and we already have the numbers 4 and 5 but some add up to 9 now the rest two cells must add up to 17 minus 9 which equals 8. Now 9 can't come in E5 so we write 7 over there, 9 over there and we need 8 so 8 minus 7 is 1 so 1 will go in cell B5. Now let's look at row 4. In row 4 the target number is 22 and we already have 9 and 8 which add up to 17. Now 22 minus 17 equals 5. Now for 5 there are two options 1, 4 and 2, 3. First let's try with 1, 4. Now 4 can't come over here because then we will repeat of the numbers. So. 4 will be over here and 1 over here. Then, if we look at column B, the target number is 15. We already have the numbers 5, 4 and 1 which add up to 10. The remaining number will be 15 minus 10 which equals 5. Now, we can't put the number 5 over here because then it will repeat of the number. So, we can't use the option 4 or 1. So let's try with 3 and 2. So we have 3 over here, 2 over here. Now 15 is the target number in column B. So we already have 5, 3 and 1 which equals 9. 15 minus 9 equals 6. And 13 minus 6 equals 7. 7 plus 2 is 9 plus 4 is 13. 22 minus 13 is 9. And for 22, we can complete it as 5 plus 9 is 14. 22 minus 14 is 8. Let's check our answers. 2, 8. 5, 9, 8. 5, 9, 8. 6, 7, 9. 6, 7, 9. 3, 2, 9, 8. 
So we go to correct. Next puzzle. Let's name the columns and rows. This will be column A, column B, column C, column D, column E. And the rows are row 1, row 2, row 3, row 4, and row 5. Now, let's look at the cell D5. Now, in that, the, the top number is 15. And we already have the number 6 and 4. Now, 6 plus 4 equals 10 and 15 minus 10 equals 5. So, in D5, the number will be 5. Let's look at column E. The target number is 25 and we already have the numbers 7, 8 and 4. Which add up to, so 8 plus 4 equals 12, plus 7 equals 19. Now 25 minus 19 is equal to 6. Next, let's look at the cell C2. Now for that the target number is 11. And we already have a 5 and 11 minus 5 equals 6. So 6 will go in C2. Now let's look at D4. The target number is 14 and we already have an 8. So 14 minus 8 equals 6. So D4 we put a 6. Now let's look at column D. The target is 26 and we already have the numbers 6 and 5 which add up to 11. So the remaining must equal 26 minus 11 which equals 15. Now for 15 we have two options which is 9, 6 and 8, 7. Now we can't use the option 9, 6 because 6 is over in D4, E3 and C2. So we can't use the number 6 which eliminates the option 9, 6. We'll use the option 8, 7. Now 7 can't come in D2 because 7 already had come over there. In the other side. So 7 will come in D3 and in D2 we put 8. Now in row 2 the target number is 26 and we already have the number 6, 8 and 7. Now 6 plus 8 plus 7 equals 6 plus 8 is 14 plus 7 equals 21. 26 minus 21 equals 5. Now, in row 3, the target number is 21. And the already filled numbers are 5, 6 and 7. Now, 5 plus 6 is 11, plus 7 is equal to 18. 21 minus 18 is equal to 3. So, 3 will go in B3. Now, let's look at column B. The target number is 14 and we already have 5 and 3. Let's add up to 8. So 14 minus 8 equals 6. Now, let's look at row, I mean column A. Now in column A we have 15. So we can write this as 8 and 7. So 8 will go over here and 7 over there. Let's check with this with the solution. So 5, 6, 8, 7, 5, 6, 8, 7, 3, 5, 7, 6, 3, 5, 7, 6, 8, 6, 6, 8, 8, 6, 6, 8, and 7, 6, 5, 4, 7, 6, 5, 4. So we have completed two Kakuro puzzles. This is all about Kokuro. Wasn't it interesting? For more useful videos, please subscribe to our channel, Brain Blitz Audios. See you soon. Bye-bye.